Okay, so I'm going to cover a topic today that uh, some of my subscribers might not have thought about before, but uh, it's uh, what the best Matrix clients are. So Matrix is a protocol uh, for messaging. Uh, it's uh, better than IRC in many ways, although it is much more uh, heavy. But uh, yeah, there's many clients for Matrix, but most of the time people just talk about Element when really there's a lot of Matrix clients, so let's get into it. So, of course, there's Element, which is a cross-platform uh, desktop and mobile and web uh, Matrix client, which looks pretty nice and, uh, yeah, it works. Uh, there's a company behind it, so it's not run by a non-profit, so that isn't too good. And, uh, yeah, they're going to have to look for ways to make money, which isn't good. Uh, so, um... So there are other alternatives though, you'll be glad to hear. So there's stuff like NeoChat, so NeoChat's made by KDE. So uh, the developers over at KDE, uh, massive respect to them. Uh, I really do like KDE uh, for Linux. Uh, but um, yeah, so they made this chat app. And the funny thing is it's not got a K uh, before it, which is quite... Uh, Usually KD put a K before their uh, product name, but this one's called NeoChat. So NeoChat, it looks pretty uh, good. I haven't tried it out yet, but I probably will do in the future. Uh, so there's also other ones, obviously. So there's Ditto Chat, uh, and that's a uh, React native client for iOS and Android and it looks really nice actually uh, so yeah but for some reason I can't work out how to uh, reply to things which is a bit of a basic feature uh, so yeah so that's one uh, good messaging app there's also uh, so these are just the ones listed on the uh, matrix website so you know but there probably will be other ones but I'm not going to cover those today uh, but there's Neo but it's Neo, yeah, I believe that's how you say it, N-I-O, and it's a iOS client for Matrix, and because I don't have an iOS device, I haven't tried it out yet, but it looks pretty cool, so, yeah, uh, I uh, think it looks pretty nice, like, a bit like iMessage, uh, but yeah, so, there's also a one called Patel, but uh, I learned that that one actually, uh, like the uh, it like the project on GitLab has been archived and I believe it's uh no longer in development. So let's uh, bush over that one. Uh, there's Flu Fluffy Chat, uh, which is another pretty nice looking uh, chat client. And for some reason, my account wouldn't work with it, so I had to set up a new account just to try it out. But uh, yeah, it looks pretty good and it's works pretty well as well so that's uh great so and also that's cross-platform with ios uh android i'm not sure if they've got a desktop client actually i don't think they do oh wait they do uh so I, i'll check that one out uh so um yeah so they also they also have a web client like uh element does so you can use it on the web now, when it comes to desktop clients, uh, there's, of course, Element, as I've already said, uh, but there's uh, mainly Linux options. So for people who are running the Mac OS, like me, uh, you are a bit out of luck when it comes to other clients because there's NeoChat, which works, although they kind of crashed for me. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, that doesn't really work. Uh, you can use Flowy Chat in the browser if you want to. Uh, but other options for every, uh, for other, you know, uh, OSs and stuff. So there's Spectacle. 
Spectral. Uh, so that's one cool uh, client which uh, looks pretty nice. It looks a bit like iMessage actually, again, or a bit like Google Messages almost. There's Quantarium. Cute, yeah. So I'm not gonna try and uh, say that, uh, but it's a I am client for Matrix which uh, works on Linux and it looks a bit old, so I wouldn't really use it. But uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. There's N Hecro Hecro Reborn, which is another Linux client, but that one looks a bit nicer uh and yeah i haven't tried those yet because yeah i've not got a linux machine right to my disposal right the second uh but i might try that at some point i might set up a like a linux virtual machine or whatever uh so there's a so a matrix so neo chat obviously i've already mentioned that one uh mirage mirage yeah so Oh uh, yes, yeah, so you know there will be links in the descriptions to all of these Matrix clients. Just because if I've absolutely murdered the pronunciation, then uh, at least you have those links, so you can definitely get to the right pages and stuff. But uh, this one is apparently a so it's meant to be customizable and keyboard operated. It looks pretty cool, but apparently it's only on Linux or something. But it, if I can get it somehow running, then I'd really like to try that one. Uh, there's so fractal, yeah. Uh, so that one, uh, it's quite similar. Quite a lot of these are very similar for some reason. So of course there's fluffy chat as I've said before, uh, and there's sea glass, which is another one, which uh, looks a lot. Yeah, it's a native client for macOS. I might try that one. Uh, that one looks pretty cool actually. So uh, yeah. If, so, if you want a terminal slash command line based one, uh, there's WeChat Matrix, so W-E-E -E Chat Matrix, and this is meant to be a plugin for the well-known uh, IRC client WeChat, with two E's, because there's also a Chinese messaging app called WeChat, but they're of no relation, so uh, don't get them confused, uh, but... um. It basically just brings Matrix support to WeChat, and uh, yeah, that's good. Uh, so there's uh, Go Muckers. I don't know how to say that, but <laughs> apparently uh, it's a terminal-based client for uh, for I believe it's Linux. I'm not sure if you can get it running on macOS, but uh, yeah, it's written in Go which is a uh, Google language, and it's very efficient and stuff. Uh, so that's good. There's Matrix CLI. I haven't looked in too much into that, uh, but it looks kind of cool. Uh, yeah, so Matrix Commander. Uh, yeah, so it's a simple CLI tool, so uh, it's a simple command line uh, thing. But what I'm saying is it's very simple, apparently. So... Uh, but it does have uh, emoji and end-to-end -end encryption support, which is cool. But uh, there's also web stuff, as I've said before, Element or is on uh, the web. But, of course, if you clicked on this video, you probably don't want to hear too much about Element. Uh, but there's also Flowy Chat on the web, so if you're ever on a... If, if you're ever on a platform which isn't supported or you just need to do it in a hurry or something and you don't need to download an app uh you can do that so there's also a matrix client for the nintendo 3ds so if you're one of those homebrew types which uh has a uh, already like kind of jailbroken in their 3ds and you can do this so you can chat on a 3ds i'm not sure how optimal that is but uh uh yeah, so there's a lot of Matrix clients, probably a few I haven't mentioned. Uh, so yeah, because Matrix is open source, anybody can make a client for it, even you can make it a client for it. So uh, yeah, it makes it very uh, interesting, the possibilities of where it can go and stuff. 
uh, that is the joy of open source, really. It's that there are so many more possibilities when you make it open source. And when you make it decentralised. And do you know what else is decentralised? Odyssey and LBRY. So, uh, you can check me out on them. And you can also check me out on DTube if you want to. Uh, you can subscribe to me on YouTube or whatever platform you're watching this on. Because I'm aware that you might be watching this on DTube or Odyssey or LBRY. So, yeah. Or whatever platform I actually am. Uh, start using in the future. You also might be watching this on Daily Motion. So there's a lot of platforms you can watch me on. You don't have to watch me on YouTube. So yeah. Uh, but uh, you can like and subscribe and share. Uh, you can uh, comment down below suggestions for future videos. Maybe you want to talk about. Maybe you want me to talk about other uh, subjects in tech and open source. Uh, whatever really. Uh, maybe comment what uh matrix client you use maybe comment like what matrix client you recommend uh, or if i've missed a matrix client because i very well might have done so yeah but uh goodbye wow that was long